Welcome to my studio. I said in my last video that I would create some shorter tutorials and I've done that and combined three in this quick demonstration tutorial showing you the use of the Deatromus ink. Now this is an ink that was highly recommended to me for use in fountain pens. Fountain pens can sometimes be a little bit sticky if you're using an ink that doesn't have a good flow and this ink flows beautifully. And now when I started choosing inks I chose the Platinum Carbon ink because that was recommended by artist groups but because I like to work with fountain pens because they hold a good reservoir of ink and they're far more economical long term than buying the disposable inks I have gone right over to fountain pens as my first love now see here I'm doing a lot of practice my writing has always been scribble and it will remain scribble as long as I tell myself I can't write well if we can't do something well it's because we don't want to do it enough to put into practice and learn how now that's a fountain pen that has a reservoir that's filled by a pump action um, so I'll be showing you a lot about fountain pens in these demonstration tutorials this one I'm showing you the varied inks now the first ink I worked with there was the urban sienna and now I'm working with a lovely gray urban gray now the practice lines that I've done in that practice session little dashes I'm using those dashes now for adding shadow just a simple work creating sketches with watercolor and I'll be adding soft pastel I'll be using mixed media in my demonstrations to create some smaller artwork that incorporates some humor now we're all very involved in some form of social media or other especially during this social distancing time that's how we're keeping in touch with our friends quite often over the internet and it doesn't take a lot of skill to put together a nice little humorous drawing add a bit of text to it I've torn the edges of this paper to create an interesting edge to the meme now I'm going across to using the brown ink and this is the again the Deatromus document ink and it's a it's a permanent ink if you leave the ink to dry on the paper overnight and then you add watercolor to it, it the ink won't bleed if I go in very quickly while my ink is wet on the paper with some water I can get some bleeding off of this ink now my line drawing is still impressionistic just like my painting I don't strive for detail particularly if you're going for humor in your work as I am here you don't have to worry about style if you practice practice and practice your own style will come I'm trying to exaggerate things um, the thing that's important about the painting in this case it's a cup of coffee and you look for a little bit of a humorous statement to go with your sketch in this case how do you take your coffee <laughs> seriously <laughs> so I've exaggerated the size of the coffee mug and had the server extending the hands with generosity serving it so you take some aspect from your sketch and you exaggerate it slightly and you have caricature it's as simple as that you don't have to excessively distort unless you're comfortable with that you certainly don't have to insult people by exaggerating them to extremes just take one aspect that you think will create some humor now do subscribe if you think you'll benefit from watching my videos or will enjoy them I'd love to have your company